Rip Game Maker Studio. So what am I referring to? Well, there has been an update to the newer version, so I just updated it and then you have to uninstall and install. Easy peasy and not an issue. And then I load it up and then I'm just like, oh, what's actually happening? And then I, for example, I don't know if I, for example, want to draw something here, just to show you a little impression on how they fixed it. And this is not an input lag or I don't know, some buffering of the video or whatever. No, this is Game Maker Studio in 10 frames or five frames per second. This is terrible. This is completely terrible. For example, if, if you just drop down the menu, what is this? Is this a bad joke? Do we have April again? Nope, we don't have any by the way. Uh, so what's that? So I thought like, hmm, maybe it's just on my side. So let's check out DirectX, check out uh, the newest Windows update because I'm using Windows 10, or maybe it's my graphics card, updated everything, checked everything, or thought like, hey, maybe because the new rendering, so here, this is the thing which they said, like, hey, they're using a new IDE rendering. So I guess this is where the issue is coming from, to make it better or whatever, but it made it worse because before that it was working nice and smoothly and it crashed extremely, extremely rarely. So I was really impressed how the IDE was handling everything. And now, what is this? And I thought like, hey, maybe it's just me because I'm using a little older PC. So I guess it's me. Then I made a little poll and 31 people, of course, this is not representative. And 23% of 31 people just said like, after that, it ran slow or slower or for me, ultra slow. So this is a terrible result for rolling out a new update. And when you read through it, they did quite a lot of things. So this is good. But what's the point of having tons of bug fixes and changes and saying like, yeah, everything's running better and smoother if it's running at five to 10 frames per second. This is terrible. First of all, from, uh, <laughs> from a point of the software is now useless for me. Second of all, uh, my channel is about Game Maker Studio 2 tutorials. And what's happening now? I cannot do my work. So from a PR standpoint, terrible. Also, of course, I'm small. I know that I have no impact impact here, but still you won't do yourself a favor if you roll out a thing which isn't working correctly. Because let's face it, small bugs, glitches, maybe some um, well, crashes or whatever. I don't really mind. This is completely fine. This is really completely fine in my opinion. Happens everywhere. So you roll out lots of changes that's completely cool i understand that once again to the engineers the guys the uh, who program the engine i don't know what you have to do here but not acceptable hopefully the next video will be a big yay from my side where i say like hey they patched it out because this fix rollout use release is not good. I'm sorry to bring you bad news to the community and for the people who actually worked hard to make this happen, change it, modernize it, to make it better. But this didn't make it better.